Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to direct to Outer Banks Season 4, Episode 5. This is like the mid-season finale. I have to wait to part 2 now after this, but that means halfway through the season. Um, so shit's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. It's gonna be great. I can't wait to see what happens. Um, the first four episodes of the season I've really enjoyed. I think I already prefer this season over the last one. Uh, I think part of it is new people new stuff happening it's not just ward again dealing with him i'm like it's finally like we're kind of moving into a new era not fully we're still in the back a little bit rafe and stuff but not completely stuck in the past if you know what i mean and i do like this mystery and this treasure hunt this one's really fun very fresh new things are happening we have lots of dead bodies kind of happening this season so, I don't know what they're going to do about the recent one. Um, trauma. A lot of stuff is happening. The Turtles. Hmm. I'm not going to get back into it. Not gonna go back. I'm not going to go back into it. Nope. Hmm. Okay. But I am ready to watch this. It is an hour long. So, uh, yeah. Really long. It's weird. But, yay. More for us. So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, check out Patreon if you want to watch this episode and all the other episodes unedited and weeks early. Also, other shows as well. Go check them out, okay? Other than that, uh, that's really it. So, I hope you enjoyed this, and without further ado, here we go. Hide the body. Hide the body. Hide the body where? Sure. Shut up. That's what we do. Hide the body where? Behind the couch. Hey, put the couch. Behind the couch? <laughs> Behind the couch. Yeah, Cleo shouldn't be there right now. That's pretty small. That's a lot of blood. I can cover that up. Cover that up. That's it. Caught wind of some shenanigans. Thought you might want to share your side of the story. Don't know what you're talking about. No idea, huh? No idea. Clear this shit up. Let's go inside. Bleach. Okay. Oh, I can still see his head. Oh, God. They're not gonna smell the bleach at all? Oh, shit. What's up, y'all? Nice shoot. Hey. Yeah, we're just hanging out. Yeah. James all here, huh? Oh, God. Hey. Yeah, they do not look... Oh, y'all, uh... Too high to hear me knocking. It's just been a been a long day. Hey, dude, <laughs> everybody, mind clearing out. Get out of your hair. Hold on. Be outside. Yeah, yeah. See you guys in a sec. Why is the only one talking to JJ? And all of them. We're good, right? What do you mean we're good? There's a body behind the couch. Okay, what do you want to do? You want to go in there and move? <laughs> no, I want to go back inside. We should have never touched him. Because we hadn't committed any crimes, and now we've committed crimes. Yep. There's nothing we can do. Maybe we should get away from the house and reevaluate. What about the smell? The smell of the dead body, the smell of the bleach. No, yeah. Uh, let's just make it quick, you know, TikTok. Let's. This is a dead body right behind him. Entertainment for you. Take a gander. Come near her. Ah, uh, so it's not about the dead guy. Okay. Is that you? AI has come a long way. AI. <laughs> Nearly killed Key. All right. You said you were gonna kill them all. Yeah, out of self-defense. Right? Yeah, he said you know if you come at me, oh my friends. You didn't say I'm going to kill you. Or saying you'd vandalized a hyperbaric chamber. What the hell is that? Well, now that well, um, yeah. Okay, I was cooked like a chicken. Like, I, I there's the improper patient care for a patient act where it, like it protects me Just from stop. Hell. Stop. <laughs> I don't want to. You've never seen him around. Who no. is he? We still don't know. I've never seen him in my life. Uh, uh, all right, that's Just sure. Appreciate it. No, oh, um, is that it? You know, no further questions, officer? Actually, come to think of it, there is something else. A lot of questions. We were here. We made a campfire. Uh, fried a fish up, and then we put on some tunes, sang some some songs, mm -hmm. and, uh, and that was it. He's not lying. Okay. 
happy to help. Thanks. But listen, son, you just gotta stay out of trouble for a minute. Yeah. And being honest with me, all right? Okay, that was a good meeting. Nothing bad came out of it, okay? Well, good. Kind of. Man, mm -hmm. did you find the body or not? No. no obviously not. not. Okay. <laughs> Why did he want to tell Sue? Yeah. Because one of the kooks recorded me saying, I'll kill you all at the beach whatever but like oh my god that, and that's why yeah it's so stupid and it has something to do with us but i told him we weren't anywhere near his place and he believed you about everything i mean key look who's son all right <laughs> he bought it yo up to handle it all right we got it okay we got nothing to worry about oh god I'm yeah i'm gonna need surveillance on these jokes oh shit so, uh, wake up, Deputy Carl. That's not gonna be good. Just lied to me. Oh. Guarantee you they're up to no good. What? Oh, I was trusting you. I thought you were good. Damn. How are they gonna hide a body when they are being watched by police? They gotta move it now. Oh, <laughs> young Rafe. Is he actually feeling a little bit guilty? Take care of each other. Is he gonna do it for his dad? Make amends with Sarah? Here it is. Hello, Goat Island. Alright. Okay. I don't trust her. I need some details from you, okay? You tell me, you're your partners. How are we doing this? When the money clears, no, why do, why do you want to give the details before the money? All will be revealed. Yeah, it's a trick. I don't trust I'm that. Looking forward to it, Rafe. It sounds so suspicious, Rafe. How can you fall for this? She's saying she doesn't want to tell you anything until after the money goes through. All will be revealed. Sus. Me and Sophia. Who you met. So. Good for you, Rafe. Oh, he does care about Sophia. Option. The zoning notice, Keith. We're gonna lose Poglandia. Chumby, they killed Terrence. <sighs> but also, way, way over our you're gonna lose the place if you don't do it. What's the plan? You move, where are you guys gonna move to with what money? Let's go to Charleston. You okay with that, Cleo? In Charleston, we could find a man who killed Terrence. Yeah, Cleo's out for vengeance. Good. I'm good with it. Yeah. Who is this lady? And the inscription is just like we said. Half Moon Battery, Charleston. That's out for Charleston. Burn gas. They figure that out real quick. So what will happen if we fail? To all of us, you hear? What will happen? Charleston. To all these people. Do they all have matching tattoos like the one guy? Do they match? Is it them? Was he one of them and that was Omar that died? What is happening? Just throw the gun back there. I don't know about that. I guess they could use it, but also, mm, I don't know. Evidence. And, uh, looks like they're hauling some bags of oysters. All right, well, get ready to follow. On it. Oh god. Be smart, you guys. Hey. I think we're being followed. There you go. Okay. I was like, wait, you guys better see. He just hit the jets, boss. I can't keep up with him. Alright, alright. That was easy. We just had to go faster, okay. I feel like I would go even deeper out of the water. Like, go as deep as you possibly can. And, um, and I loved him. Mm. And I'm gonna miss him. Terrence was a good guy. I ain't gonna forget who did this. Oh, no, you won't. I ain't got you, boss. Yep. Yeah. 
Is that? No, no. What? Who is it? It's the cops. Oh, go. Get ready. Get ready. Oh God. Jesus. Oh. Oh my Jesus. shit. Oh, it's. You almost made me a killer. Yeah. But you ain't. Not yet. Anyways, Mr. Generate wanted me to give this to you. Oh, the letter he was writing before he died. Uh, what was it? What's this? Hmm. Don't know. But he said you'd want it. Ooh. Oh, we about to figure out how he's connected to him, the son, the dead son, or something. Bastards. Change your name. What? what, what? Read it. Read it out loud. Freaking curses. <laughs> what? What's it say? Come on. What are you doing? Don't do something stupid. His handwriting is fascinating. Right, I got another one of these suckers on the move. Well, what do you want to do, boss? Just try to keep up this time, will you? You got it. And this time they're gonna actually follow him because he has slow boat. Really, really sorry about that bullshit on the beach yesterday. It's no excuse, you know. Good, like, Rafe. Proud of you. Pogue this, pogue that. Oh, you finally done with that shit? Fine. I don't care. I'm not like toppering him, you know. I know. I mean, my dad started. My dad started off as a poke. It doesn't matter. Mm-hmm. Sure. Well, you. Mm. I want to be like him. Maybe not just like him. I want to get this family back together. And uh, I'm going to make up with my sister. And I really want you with me. And when this goes out. He out, really cares about her. Maybe keep a little piece of it for myself. And this could be. This could be for us. Oh. You know? He is falling for her. And she just helped the lady probably rip him off and steal all of his money. Are you not into it? No, I, I am. But I, once I just, he learns you betrayed his trust, I, he does not like that. Hot for it. Yeah, I know. I just, I think it's too risky. I think you should wait. You already did it. Oh, hey, we're gonna make ten times the amount that I put into it. Okay. Yeah. I don't know about that. Both of us. Whatever plan she has for you, it's not good. Go on to Chuck Town without me catch up with you later, JJ. Since when has JJ ever run errands? <laughs> yeah. Since never. Hey, it's JJ. You know what to do at the beach. Anything key? He's gonna go to Ireland, isn't he? You should go. Y'all go ahead. I'll hang back and if we can, we'll catch up with you later. Plus. Why do we always have to split up? As well. Yeah. Okay. Why is he wearing a sweater? It is not cold out here. Why is he here? It's coming. I had a pretty little rain. Well, uh, just want to ask you something. I'm trying to track down the pops. Oh, looking for his dad. The last I heard, he was somewhere south of Belize. I mean, like, oh. shit, I know he's asking. I ain't seen him, bro. He's a wanted man. And I'm a law abiding citizen. Okay. If he comes up for air, just let me know. It's going to be mad money for him and maybe a little for you as well. So, uh -huh. let me know. Wait. You got the bait. Works every time. Thank you very much. Did the dog ever shut up? Please don't say anything about my dog. Mm -hmm. Yeah, be nice to the dog. More like a commune. Actually, we, mm -hmm. we got jobs. Had jobs. Yeah. Right. I know you're trying. It's okay. fine. I'm just, <laughs> I'm, Listen, I'm just more. And then maybe we get a dog. And maybe we start a family. And All right. 
No. You wait, had me hey, right hey, up until hey, that hey. point. <laughs> I, 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 I didn't keep thinking about the biological clock, and I know it's male. Like, I, I, biological clock. <laughs> I'm literally 19. I know. You have plenty of time to have a child. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. It's good to hear your voice. What's he about? Yeah. What about talk about? Generous. No bueno. Stay away. Mm. Yeah, no, well, uh, Why? It's a little too late for that. What? But, What's going on with the dog? You say you were? I don't know, boy. He's literally in the Here's house. Hey, down, down. He's, oh my god. His big hiding is just in the house right there. It's so stupid. Yeah, Barracuda. I know he's in here. Just come in here. Hooting and hollering. Oh, shut up. Right, just settle oh, down. Let's chat. Shit. Barracuda Mike, I know you're not the one digging all this book, right? <laughs> yeah. You're just a kid. You know that? You don't know shit. You don't know I'm shit either. In there or he's coming out, okay? He's right there. He's your douchebag of a father. See ya. He looks disgusting. When was the last time he took a shower? Well, I'm here now. No, yeah, you don't get a hug. I wanted man. I, I didn't want you to get in trouble. It's just... So, um, so he just left him alone to deal with things himself. That's just thing about question rep. He just cares about the money. Hmm, I want to know. But he left me this. I got it after he died. What does it say? No, I was hoping maybe you could explain it for me. What, 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 what? Did he have an affair with the mom that was married to the other man? And she had his baby, and then he, she was killed or died? I'm writing in regards to a matter of utmost importance about this matter. I believe it best that you first talk to your father. Ask him about Albatross. Albatross? You're not Terry. What? His grace will grant me the pleasure of your company. When all has come to light. Yours truly, Wes Jenrett. What is Albatross? I mean, Albatross. No clue. Don't lie. That's bullshit. I don't know. Okay. I don't know. No, it's bullshit. I know when you're lying. Yes, I'm calling you a liar. Yes, you a liar. I know when you're lying. You better put this coop bullshit. You know what? Whatever you stole from him, I don't even care. Sorry to ruin your vibe. You still a baby? Just don't waste my time. Oh, because they followed him, they found him. Stop! Come on, boys, get your head around back to the dock. Hey. Leave your dad. Leave your dad behind. He doesn't deserve to be saved by from you. Come on, Jay. I'll tell you everything. Oh, oh, you now you have to. Come on. Come on. We need. I need answers more than I care about you getting arrested right now. Past him, it's point now. Problem with all these people with boats is that if you try to chase them and get police on them, it's hard. They can just hop on a boat and leave. Dude, where are you? Hey, can I help you? Uh, okay. Oh, God. Hey, Key. Ah. Uh, what are you doing here? Uh, yeah. Do you, what, you don't think I'm, uh, just a customer coming to no no you're not surf and date store no. these two haven't had a moment in a little while at the break gave it up for those turtles it was super fun to watch it was awesome you, you say these things and then you say these things and it's like opposite and such a bad boy you're the brother and I, I want to be better but I, I already you're not just snapping at me because I, I'm trying to help. You gotta try harder, buddy. I mean, you guys, you guys always wonder why you end up at the bottom of the soup chain. It's, it's. You guys. It's, it's my business card. Tell Sarah to hit me up. I think I can help. What? You come in so ominous and creepy, but then you want to help? You really did me wrong. You did, yeah. did I? But 
you've also done her and everyone else wrong, so. But I forgive you, we're good. Sure you do. All right. It's like he says one thing to Sophia, and then he comes here, acts all weird and creepy, not so genuine, saying nice things, but in a weird way. It's it's also off. <laughs> The, oh. the, the, uh, the, the blockade of Charleston. That was eighth grade history. <laughs> the Charleston blockade? What's the difference? It's, it, it is different. <laughs> anyway, so half moon? Battery? Yeah. So I guess we just head inland. I guess so. Chop, chop. Let's follow the directions. Okay. I have a question. So if we're talking about caskets, that doesn't mean that we're going to another cemetery, right? <laughs> Oh, in Charleston, my sister lives here. I've never been there, though. I've never visited her. Hope. We've been walking for forever. My feet hurt. Mm -hmm. What are we doing? Oh, I get that. Listen, you, hunt, you hunt for the treasure. It doesn't come to you. You said you knew where we was going. I said I knew the general was saying. You're just walking straight? He's being pursued by the British Royal Navy. They're blockading the entire city. Yet he finds time to make coffins, to bury his cook, and his navigator? Yeah, it is weird. Time out, time out, time out. Dude, he definitely put something in those coffins. Yeah. 100%. I figure it's a cemetery. Shit. All we have to do is figure out where the... Maybe the one right is? here. What? Right, look. That? Right there? That's gotta be the North Star. The uh, North Star will guide the way. There you go. Oh, Church. Sarah Cameron. <laughs> have I told you I love you lately? <laughs> And you for diversions. I need to check something outside the church. You're on cemetery. <gasps> Wait, what? Uh -huh. For the gatekeeper. And the gatekeeper will guide the way. No, no. Let's go. Close. No. You just got benched. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I'm not. I don't. You got benched, John B. John B will provide. This is gonna be awesome. It's not real. They're dead. It's all uh, a fear of graveyards, of all the things, <clears throat> all the things you've done and seen, John B. Really. <clears throat> a place where the living and the dead collide. So I need you guys to distract the priest while I look around. Sarah, hey, mm -hmm. you with me? Mm -hmm. She's thinking about pregnancy now. Yeah. How hard can it be? <laughs> Don't break things. <laughs> with us, over my friend here, she has recently been diagnosed. With a terrible disease. Polio. Polio. <laughs> but I thought polio had been eradicated. <laughs> you could have just gone with like cancer or something. Very slow moving polio. Late, late onset. Tragic. <laughs> Meaning miracle. Well, I would be happy to lead you in prayer if you'd like. Thank you. Thank Are they wearing matching that. tops right now? Well, almost matching. In prayer. Help us to trust in your divine no. and teach us to hoist in your promises. Grant this young man in the organ. Thank you. Oh, underneath there, where he's standing. Mama, hey, hey, I got it. I think I got it. What? Oh, we got with wet man. Yeah, something underneath there. What are you doing? A lot of these old churches, the crypts, buried under the altar. Oh. oh, I'm sure they won't mind. They, no, they won't mind at all. Okay, guys, this is like sacrilege. It's, no, it's, it's, it's not great. I think God will understand. Really? What are you doing? You're ripping with your carpets. So many things. Ooh. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. How did you? Wait, Because okay. he's Pope. Blue crown, Blackbeard's most famous treasure. Apparently in a coffin. Uh, coffin yeah. Buried 300 years ago. Got it. Now. Got it. Okay. Two of us go down there. One of us stays here and keep watch. Not it. Uh -huh. Rock paper scissors. Yep. Rock paper scissors. Shit. <laughs> Where the hell? I'll stay back. It's you and me. Chris Cameron. <laughs> Sarah and Pope. We'll have a little adventure together. Love it. Yell if anything happens. Like we're gonna be able to help from down here. Don't worry, we already got prayed over. <laughs> Polio. <laughs> I 
Oh god, let's do it. Right back on them. That's good. That's not fun. No one's ever noticed that before and looked. Oh, Rutledge. Oh. Oh, wow, they did a whole thing for him. Never seen it before. Uh oh. They're here. Come on. Can this be the one? Yes, it can. Isn't that bad? Careful. Stay hidden. A lot of cobwebs. Ugh. Gotta check it out. Confederate money from the Civil War. Wow. Bybee was here 150 years before that. Yeah. It's crazy. Keep pushing. Okay. This makes me feel weird, Pope. Understandably, really. Oh, something there. Hold on a second. Hold this. That's one line. Mm. Yeah, it's the only thing you got. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Could you just push that in with your hand? Nose goes. <laughs> Good job, Sarah. You still go first. <laughs> Could I Fair. have a flashlight? Oh, yeah, sorry. I'm doing this again. You guys know I don't like caves. <laughs> and you know I don't like tunnels. And you keep going to caves and tunnels. <laughs> I would be the same way. This is too tiny. I'm not doing this. Hold on. How much further? Unclear. Un I think we should just keep moving. Oh, God. Okay. Do you want to keep complaining? No, yes. I'm not complaining. I'm saying facts. Yeah, I agree. Let me say what I need to say to get through this. I need to complain sometimes to make it through bad things. It's so cool. Is that a mouse? Rat. Pope? Yeah. Bats. What is that? Bat. Yeah. Okay. What is that? Bats, 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 rats, rats, rats. Don't freak out. Sarah, Sarah, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, Sarah. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh, oh, ow. Oh, ow. Oh, ow. You gotta jump, Sarah. Ah, ooh. Watch out, Pope. Oh. <laughs> I, I couldn't tell. Did you hear a lock? Yes, that sounded like a lock. That's not good. There's gotta be another exit pod. Be my guest. I have a feeling the people up by the angel are about to make one or open it. Skulls and fears. Oh. This is a real catacomb. Wow. Where the living and the dead collide. Oh. A piece that opens a door. I love that. How very um, Indiana Jones. Let's crack it open. National treasure. Well, guys, what? Oh, she's pointing. Where is she pointing? To there. Oh, okay. Where are you guys? Where's um Cleo? She'll be right there. I think we're close. These are cribs. Spooky. Yep, and people now. And the clip. Oh. Good fault. Oh, the rat, rat. Not deal with your fear of rats, Sarah. Wow. 
A map. So no treasure, but a map to the treasure. Held here for three hundred years. What's that tell you? Mm. Who's there? I'm so nervous. They have the map or whatever it is now. Now how'd they get out of here? Probably the way they came. Or you think they went out that way? Ew. Don't like that. <laughs> it's clear we're gonna be there. Ready to kill him. They're locking it back up. Oh no. So they can't get out that way. Shit. So we need we need that to unlock it. Shit. Where are you guys? Cleo, what are you doing? Oh. He's ready. She's ready to kill him. Sir, there's a ladder back here. It's our way out. Come on. You're getting a lot of showers after this. All right. This must be how they got out. You think that'll hold? Held them. It held That's them. Sketchy. It's not the sketchiest thing I've had to climb. Mm -hmm, true. Cleo! Help! Cleo! Help! Oh, God. I don't know. Cleo's got... We got to get the pendant, because we can't... Without that, we can't do anything. So we need that... And I think she's gonna have to just make a decision of what to do, killing or taking it. Oh god. Shit. How did they know? Go, go, dude! Big dude, go. What the hell? Get off she's looking at us. Neither. We go what we need. Definitely. Oh god, gross. You need the pendant though, or a sledgehammer. It's okay, Cleo. Ooh. They'd have good aim. Be like his dad. Okay, so we don't have the pendant, uh, no, amulet thing. We need a sledgehammer to open that shit up before they drown and die. Okay, new plan. We go back the way we came and find another way out. But that door's locked. I know, I know. I can't move this. Okay, I'm coming back down. I don't know if we can. The water's starting to fill up, isn't it? Ew. Ew. Is the water level of higher you? Obviously. Duh. How high do you think it goes? Articles. All the way up. But and they go up to the ceiling. So. This place is gonna fill up. Yeah. You're about to drown. God damn. Dad, wait. Where, where the hell are we going? Come on, Jay. This way. We're going to the lighthouse? Up here, up here. Okay. Well, it's gonna be a safe bet here. Come on. Really? It's just up here. Trust me. A safe bet on top of a lighthouse? I'm not the best history with lighthouses on this show. Now you're gonna explain yourself? Tell us some truths. Yeah, I'm not sure why I did that. Yeah? Uh just my Remembered a little bit about Albatross. You maybe, you think? Hmm. And? What that is it? That was the name of the boat that Clarissa Jenrette died on. Okay. They didn't tell you anything? No. Dad, That's I why don't... he's asking. I'm 
not your blood bond, Jay. Oh. What? I thought he was like, his father, the woman. Is he the other guy's son? Not my blood, anyway. Oh, my. The person you thought was your mother, she's just my girlfriend. Oh. Your real mom? Larissa Jenrette. Ooh, I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Larissa, the one that died, that's the one you're talking about. Mm hmm. Look. Now, are you messing with me? I swear to you. Are you messing with me? I swear to you. When I took you on, I, I was I was just It's quite a lot to learn. I was just trying to help. Isn't it obvious? Yeah. Yep, I knew it. He's the dad. He she's the mom. Oh, his daddy's evil too. And it's going to be glorious. Well, and I knew he was working with her. These two are together. Oh my god. Evil. An evil couple. What's their plan? I can't wait for these next five episodes, you guys. I can't believe we have to wait to see what happens. We have Pope and Sarah drowning in a catacombs under a church in Charleston. And then we have JJ learning that his mom is the dead lady of the dead man that hired them. And his dad is actually alive. And the rich guy who seems to be suspicious and is working with, um, what's her name, who um, just made a deal with Rafe. So what is their plan? Are they trying to take all of them out, basically? Because I have a feeling Rafe is being tricked and it's like, I don't buy it. The way she's saying, you'll see, you'll see, giving no information. I'm like, no, I don't trust that. I would not make a deal with someone with that information of what actually is happening, who she works with. I would want some information before giving that much money. I, I love you, Rafe, but um, business sense, it's not the smallest move to make a deal without any information. It's ridiculous. Even if your girlfriend says she thinks it's a good idea, it doesn't make it a good idea. <sighs> Crazy. That whole thing is interesting because she's lying to him he seems to actually really care and love her, even though he said that one comment that made her feel not so much. Oh, he's going to hate it when he learns that she betrayed him. It's going to be bad. And he seems to kind of want to make friends with the Pogues and his sister again, but also doesn't. It's like he wants to, but deep down inside, he can't help but be an asshole to them. It's very weird. He's like, I don't care about Pogues and Kooks. But he does. It's, it's a lot. I don't know. Um, and then chasing down this thing in Charleston, going to the catacombs and all that, catacombs, and dirty water and rats and all this, and these two people find it, of course, get the treasure map or whatever, a scroll, and leave with it without any problem. Too easy. And now they're locked down there. They're going to have to get, like, sledgehammer to just open it up, I guess, before they drown. But they're on the other side right now, so they're going to have to swim back and up. They should have... I don't know. It's hard. I would say they should stay on the side with the ladder because that's a hot, taller. It's higher up, so it buys them more time. But the chances of them breaking that is harder. The other side, maybe opening that door another way, there is a way, maybe. So it's like, you got to... Play or maybe stay on that side for a little while, and if you can't figure it out, then go back to the other side before it's too hard to swim under and up. Yeah, think smart here. We have to buy some time so John B. and Cleo can open it up for them. Hmm. I don't know what's going to happen here. I don't know. I'm worried about... I, Sarah and Pope are going to be fine. I, feel, I can feel fine with that. I'm worried about this... JJ's dad and this woman that made a deal with Pope and what they're up to. I need to remember their names. Next time I'm going to have to look at IMDb to actually, like, look at their names and be like, who the fuck are they? Because I keep forgetting. But I don't see any good there. With the whole Goat Island thing, what do they want? What is their goal here? Why kill the old man? 
if he knows if he had a feeling JJ was his son, why isn't he doing anything about it? Why is he trying to throw JJ and his friends under the bus and get them arrested for murder? Whatever happened, what happened to what actually happened to JJ's mom? Like, what did the husband kill him, kill her? And then JJ's dad saved him and took him away to help him. I don't know. I need a backstory on that. I need some more story history on it, okay? Um, I am very excited to see what happens in the second part of this season, though. I can't wait for it. I saw that there was a, a part two trailer. I think I'm not going to watch it. I'm not going to react to it. I'm just not going to watch it at all. Because by the time this comes out on YouTube, this episode... Part two is probably already going to begin. So, I'm like, at that point, there's no point in putting the trail out and then reaction. I'll just continue when it comes out. I'm not going to watch it either. I think, no spoilers. Let's just go into this. Open minds and see what's going to happen. Okay? So, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, go to Patreon, all that fun stuff. I hope you enjoyed or having a fantastic day. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.